Darren and Anita. A music evolution. Hi, Darren here with Darren and Anita on Grand Strand, the radio show. And you know, ever so often with CBMZ, I like to bring you what's going on with the artist out and about. Well, I have the pleasure right now with me via Skype from their England tour. We have Ken Knox and Thomas Hunter who are with me. Brandon Stevens and Dee Washington who are with them. They're out and about this afternoon over there. But with me right now from England via Skype is Ken Knox and Thomas Hunter. So what's up, fellas? I tell you, over in England going on, this has got to be a great thing. How, how's the shows been over there? The pictures that I've seen from Facebook, it looks exciting. The fans look excited. The fans are excited, and uh, we're excited. Um, it was, uh, I mean, each night has been phenomenal. What do you say? I don't think so, yeah. It's been really great. The fans here are, are really receptive to uh, everything that we're doing, and it's just amazing me how much they love our music. It's, it's been a blast every I, night, every performance. Well, the place. Every, sorry, been, we, we have a little cool. delay going on here. Sorry, Thomas. Uh, but I was going to ask you too. The rooms that you guys are playing over there are incredible rooms. I've seen like castles and and out beside the ocean and all kinds of stuff. Yeah, uh, I think the first night was like a chateau. They called it a chateau. It, it was a uh, uh, chateau hip empty. And I don't know what that means, but um, it was a great venue. Uh, as soon as we walked out on the stage, they went, they went into a roar. And uh, from start to finish, it was like that. And that was chateau. That was, that was a Friday night. And Saturday night was... Saturday night, we were at the uh, Wolverhampton, and it was a great crowd. Uh, the people loved us. The people loved us. <laughs> so, Thomas, how, and, uh, how, Thomas, uh, Thomas, how were they liking that growl that you do when you get down and you get they, down in the crowd? <laughs> they loved it. As always. As always. <laughs> And now that Thomas has got a little Fu Manchu going on as well, man, the ladies got to eat that up overseas. They love it. <laughs> he keeps it fresh every day. <laughs> <laughs> well, what exciting is going on in England besides the shows and what you guys are doing? What Are you finding food? I know I talked to you guys before you left, and you're a little concerned of finding some food to eat. Not anymore. It started with the flight over. I mean... If they didn't come every 15, 20 minutes with food, it was unreal. So I know when we get back, we're gonna, we have probably gained 30 pounds with three more shows to go. Um, I'm going to get back to the, uh, you you talking about locations. Yes. This little venue that Tom was speaking of is right on the North Sea. The North Sea. Across the water was Norway. Wow. And uh, I think we had the best, speaking of food, with the best fish and chips you ever had. Cool. It it looks incredible, and I saw. I think uh, Brandon. I know Brandon and Dee aren't with you guys right now. They're they're out. I guess seeing things. But I know he took a picture of the sea there to where you guys were at, and it was really awesome to see that. Yeah. Yeah, it was. It was. It was. It was totally awesome. Uh, yeah, we've had a lot. We got we've had a lot of really amazing uh, places to perform in. The scenery has been really unreal. It really has. It's, it's like we were at one place and it was like being in a storybook. I think that might have been the Chateau, if the, the yeah. castle that you saw. Right. It was like being in a storybook. It was really really nice. And then when we got to the Wolverhampton, you know, as Ken was saying, across from Norway. It was really an amazing sight to see the beaches. I mean, the way the water came across the sea. And we were right there on the edge of the water. Wow. Where performing. And then uh, the next night we were in a place called Mansfield, which was a theater. And uh, it, was, it was a great theater. And we had a great crowd. And we were received very well. In fact, we, we, we received a standing ovation. Wow. Yes, we did. At Mansfield, at the, at the uh, Palace Theater, matter of fact. Um, we 
already sit the standing ovation. It was great. And they're already asking us to come back. Wow, that, that's <laughs> awesome right there. That tells, that tells it all right there when they ask you to come back. I know they must have put out the red carpet for you guys because I even seen in some of the pictures uh, that are being posted these chairman of the board things right outside that has the, the whole logo and everything of you guys being there and doing this tour. It, it, that's just incredible, man. It is. I mean, the, uh, the marketing and uh, the banners for the marketing are incredible. People were, were coming up with, with these posters this big. Incredible. And, uh, and <laughs> it, <laughs> I know but, they did hats for you guys as well. I think it was Casio hats or something like that. Matter of fact, a, 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 a gentleman and his wife, Neil and Jackie, for the past, see, last week and this week, they took us out to to eat Indian cuisine. And last night, um, Thai and Cantonese. Did we had Thai and Cantonese. Thai and Cantonese last night. Wow. Uh, the promoter took us out one night for the Thai food. It's, it's, all we've done is eat. <laughs> but, you know, we, 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 we've used a lot of energy on stage, so, hey, we needed it. Well, hey, look, yeah. you were talking about eating. I have never been in, I got to travel with you guys a few times uh, about a year or so ago, and that's all you do is eat, man. We're stopping, like, all the way to the beach we were eating. <laughs> well, hey, that's, that's when you're on the road, that's you part. Of, that's that's part of your, it's part your of being there. You gotta stop, get food when you don't even want it. <laughs> it's just it's a habit. It is. For but you. in this in this case, like I said before, we left. We talked about we were worried about food. No problem, man. Oh, man. The exactly. food is fantastic. Well, and I hate to say this, but forty years ago we, <laughs> we survived on fish and chips. Not <laughs> anymore. It's great. Every restaurant we've gone to has been fantastic. Right? Absolutely. And, and, and as far as the hats, this, uh, Neil has uh, uh, made us these KCO hats. We have sweatshirts. You guys can see everything in there. Yeah, I see, it. Back, see it. I've actually, on, our radio, on the radio show Facebook page, I've been sharing some of your video, I think, of you guys harmonizing one night and some other pictures, like the picture of the ocean and some things like that that you guys are doing. Well, what else is exciting before we go? We'll let you guys know, because I know it's way later over there than it is here. What else exciting that has happened that you might give us a little something of? Well, hold on, there's a party going on, there's a party going on, hold on. What's the more exciting, I'm sorry, Darren, I didn't hear the question. Would you repeat it, please? I said, what else exciting can you guys tell us about that has happened while you guys have been over there, just maybe out and about, or maybe while you guys were on stage? Oh, well, hmm. the whole, every moment that we've been here on stage has been exciting. I can't, particularly, I can't even choose one particular instance, you know, of anything happening because it's all been so, it's such an exciting trip. Everything has been, it's been moment by moment by moment. I've been feeling like this lady is laughing in the background. Like, <laughs> I, I hear her. The entire time I've been here. Well, guys, I tell you what, I'm going to let you go. I know it's later over there. Tell Brandon and Dee that we said hello and we wish we could have talked to them too. And I want to catch up with you guys when you get back to the States on the radio maybe and just to let us know what these last few shows were like. Absolutely. Okay. Um, okay. As you know, like you said, you've seen the pictures. You would definitely see the pictures. And um, who knows? You, let me just say something else, too. Yes. The executives. The executives. They, um, they're waiting on us to get, get back. Because the next trip over, they will be with us. And uh, they're all excited. Um, they're, they're posting everything that we're doing. And uh, it's just like yourself. And it's it's great. I mean, we, we, we've got a lot of love from the people here and love from our fans yes, back in the States. We did because they've, they've been uh, loving everything that we've been posting and uh, congratulating us and, and telling us to be safe and have a great time. Good deal. I can't. Now, go ahead, Ken. I'm go sorry. Ahead. Go ahead. 
I said, I can't wait to see you guys back in the States and Anita and I get you on the radio and, and find out more about the story and maybe we won't have the lady in the background uh, uh, laughing as well. <laughs> I, I, I wish, I don't want to intrude, but I, was, I would, <laughs> might turn the camera on so you can see them. But anyway, uh, uh, it's, it's, it's been great, man. And um, what, time, what, what time is it there? Right now here, it, it is uh, about 5 o'clock. What time is it you guys' time? 9.42. It is 9.42. And we got to hit the hay because we, uh, roll call is at 11. And, and, we hit, and we hit the roll at 2. So we're excited, man. You, you, might get, you, may, get, you may get Skype at tomorrow's venue. You All never right. Know. Cool deal. Give us a Skype and we'll do a little something and we can get it out there. Uh, for the folks on the radio show and, and for folks here in, in the States to get to see you guys over in the UK. It's awesome. Thank you so much for taking time this late at night for you guys, especially when you got to play tomorrow and rehearse as well. And uh, we'll see you when you get back. Yeah. Bye, man. Ken Knox and Thomas Hunter right there, chairman of the board, KCO, Ken Knox and Company from their England tour. Uh, they have three more shows and then they're coming back to the States. I thank you guys so much for coming on and talking with me and, and the fans and letting know what's going on over in the UK. You guys be safe and uh, we'll see you down the road. Folks, stay tuned. We've got more. Don't forget the radio show, DarrenAndAnita.com, and we'll bring you more as uh, we get it. See you down the road. Darren and Anita, a music evolution.